My name is Mariam de Gorge. I am a lecturer and researcher with a special interest in the field of neuroinformatics, which is a scientific study of information flow and processing in nervous system. This is an interdisciplinary field of advanced artificial intelligence that stands at the intersection of neuroscience and information science. Brain is the most complex organ in the human body. There is a huge amount of spatiotemporal data collected by neuroscientists through different devices such as electroencephalogram or EEG that records the cortical activity from a number of electrodes attached to the skull. The brain signals are spatiotemporal data that represent the dynamics of neurons over time. Information processing mechanism in the human brain has been always the source of inspiration for several computational modeling and AI. However, an efficient integration of space and time components of brain data into one unifying model has been always a challenge in AI technology. My research is developing a sophisticated spatiotemporal brain data machine as an analytical tool which has neurobiologically plausible architecture to map the brain data into a three-dimensional space that can incrementally learn from brain dynamics to capture meaningful patterns for the purpose of classification and prediction of cognitive states. My work has been successfully applied to various neurological and psychological applications for detection and prediction of brain states, such as depression and cognitive impairment. Also applied to marketing space for prediction of consumer choices and preferences. In addition to develop and implement AI technologies, I am very passionate about knowledge dissemination in state-of-the-art AI and raising public awareness, especially among women in science and technology space. That's why I have been a keynote speaker in different events and seminars to share my research outcomes and initiate collaborative projects that can improve decision-making and decision support in mental health and neurological applications towards improving well-being. What I like so much about my work is it's actually meeting with many high-profile people and experts across different domains. My research has also attracted the attention of the New Zealand Prime Minister owing to its novelty when she visited us at Auckland University of Technology.